Good morning. Um, it's been a few days. I haven't really had anything to talk about, and um, honestly, I've I really just wanted to do nothing. Um, this weekend, it, it's Monday, July 15th. Um, yesterday, I went to the park nearby, and I watched some free music, which was good. And, uh, not much else. <laughs> I slept a lot. Um, I sat around a lot. I did do all my exercise yesterday. I usually don't do any, I don't, I usually don't even wear the watch on Sunday, but I got all my exercise plus, which is good. Um, so it's very important to me to keep compensated and to keep moving and I'm, I'm noticing a lot more muscle is coming in. I'm starting to get my body back to the way it was. Except for the the fat that's not coming back. Um, I am gaining weight. I now weigh 157. A, a lot of that is muscle. Um, which is good. My clothes still fit. I'm not having any problem fitting into the, you know... I'm a size 12 slash 34, and um, I'm still wearing those. So, you know, I'm not thin, exactly. I still have some weight on me in case, you know, things go south again. Nobody's telling me to lose the weight. You know, even though at 5'3", 157, it, it, I'm overweight. You know, I'm, I'm not obese anymore, but I am overweight. Although, there's controversy on how much the BMI really... Uh, how accurate it really is, so, but, uh, doing well, I was thinking about, you know, how compensated versus decompensated this morning, and how important it is for me to stay at this level, and, um, I think it'll be okay, I'm starting to, I can see my face looks different, uh, it hasn't exactly filled in, but I just look more healthy. The jaundice is pretty much gone. You know, the Billy Rubin going down to 4.3. Um, excuse me. It's good. Um, and the jaundice, um, out of all my symptoms, because you don't want it to not go away. That's not a good thing. Jaundice, edema, and ascites are the things that scare me the most. They're the things I do not want to see. So, you know, I sit a lot, uh, so I get up so that I can, so I don't get just your normal sort of foot swelling from sitting all day. Um, yeah, because I, 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 I don't want to be on a low sodium, low fluid diet. I really don't want to do that. I'm already on a restrictive enough diet. Um, so, keep your fingers crossed that it doesn't get any worse. I don't think so. Not now. Not for a while. I don't even really get a lot of fatigue anymore. The exercising really seems to help with that. Um, mostly I'm sleeping through the night, which is good. It's great. I'm not even waking up at like two or three anymore, which I had been for w months, weeks. <laughs> um, now, of course, this could change any day, of course. Um, yeah, my PCP is on leave, so I'm not going to be seeing, I, I guess I was supposed to have seen him last week, um, I don't have an appointment with him till October, and I might have said this already, but I think I might use this time to decide whether or not I, I just want to go with a new PCP, because my last one went on leave too, and then she only worked on Wednesdays, and then, well, my liver problem showed up and I need a doctor that's available. I'm not just sick on Wednesdays. And even on Wednesdays she wouldn't call me back because she had to deal with all her other patients. So, I don't want to do this again. And I do want someone younger. I thought that, you know, maybe that he traded my dad and that they are friendly and that he has contacts at UCLA would help, but I don't think so. I 
it's time to move on, I think. I'm pretty sure. So, um, I'll do that in the next week or two, I think. Uh, well, no news is good news in this case. Uh, feeling great. Had a good weekend. I'm ready for the week. I'm going to work all week. So, this week I'm starting a uh, high performing um, employees program. I was in the first one when I when I first found out I was sick last October and I had to drop out. I was on my way to being a data engineer. I was getting my certifications. I was might have been there by now. But uh, I, I can't spend my weekend studying, you know, eight to ten hours a day anymore. I so but but even if I can't have that for my future, because I am, I am getting old, older, and I was already a little old to be getting into data engineering, because after the data engineering, I wanted to move on to AI. Um, and I can still do that, I can still study that, but it's going to take me longer, and I, I could just do it as a hobby, it's fine. But I do have a future to tend to, so this, this leadership group is a good way to start. I'll make, I'll, I'll tell my story. Maybe I'll stick in the minds of some people who do move on. You know, life is a game of chess. And sometimes little moves that we make pay big dividends later. So this isn't where I thought I would be. But I gotta kill, still keep walking. I gotta, I gotta keep moving. I gotta try. I can't just let this defeat me. Anyway, thank you for watching, and I'll talk to you soon.